all right yes thank you very much for staying with us once again and joining us on this channel sports 7 gh so ghana black stars lost the fourth african cup of nations qualifying game versus sudan yesterday far away in libya 2-0 it ended for ghana and um it's been a sad news and a bad one for the whole of the country yes today i'm monitoring everywhere from morning shows to sports shows and everybody is very very much concerned very very much saddened with the state of ghana football with the state of our black stars and in fact everybody looks to agree with me that there is no need for any calculations ghana frame ghana black stars will not qualify for the african cup of nations for the first time in 24 years ghana if I, in 20 years the last time we went was in two ta we didn't go to the african cup of nations was in tunisia 2004 so in 20 years ghana will not qualify for the african cup of nations 2019 we went and then we it was in egypt we went we exited in the round of 16 it was a big one it was a huge one because due, before 2019 the least ghana will go was quarter finals we were going to the semi-finals quarter finals finals the semi-finals quarter final and then 2019 we were exited at the 20 um, at the round of 16 it was so huge for us and then 2021 in cameroon we exited at the group stages when comoros beat us it was so huge for us in 2023 exited at the group stages again and then now we are failing to qualify for an african cup of nations that will host about 24 teams 24 teams ghana is failing to qualify or we fail to qualify you see that is the sad aspect of this whole thing you know? At first, and eh, before 2019, the number of teams that were going for the African Cup of Nations was just 16 teams. 16. This group, you know, Anka, we were supposed to top the group before we qualify to the African Cup of Nations. Do you get a point I'm making? But right now, no, the the teams are so many that we are we have 24 teams. Even the likes of Mauritania, the Sudan, Comoros. All these teams are getting the chance to qualify because CAF has opened the number of teams. Ah, Erade, Emi Yakra. Jordan, are you and Atizigi fighting? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. As if I tell that, I'm going to go to the bottle, Bobitrim Gray. Yes. Ghana's assistant, in fact, goalkeeper's trainer, Fatal Dauda, hits a technical team member of Sudan with bottle. And that is also very serious. We are going to talk to you about some of the latest news coming out from the Black Stars camp. There are a lot of revelations, deep secrets that we have to share with you in this video. I am sad. Do all to subscribe to the channel, like the video, hit the notification bell, select or leave your thoughts, comments below in the comment section. If you have any, what do you have to say about all of the issues, all of the things happening and about the disgrace and disaster the Black Stars of Ghana have brought to the nation. There's, there's, since I started watching football, eh, there's been only two times, just two times I've been very sad watching a football game just two times in fact when barcelona lost to um liverpool it was 7th may i've forgotten but it was 7th may i remember it very well because it was my birthday barcelona lost 4-0 to liverpool at the anfield we couldn't qualify to i think it was semi-finals or finals of the uefa champions league that day i was so sad because oh Charlie. Match me yam come am is oh basa mon share na chese and you mire no menko pe fried rice be crane dinner men in j afidi basa me bev di oma yasho mo me ra ho and then yesterday Ghana Black Stars losing to Sudan 2-0 look these two times and I'm ra ho as a as a football fan I've been so sad look when even Bayern Munich scored Basa A2 I wasn't this sad I've been sad because I just cannot understand how Ghana will lose 2-0 to Sudan Ghana oh Ghana Black Stars Ghana Black Stars will lose 2-0 to Sudan now Jordan Ayu and Atizi Gin Tokwa Gidi 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 Masa it started on the football field and then the reports we are getting is that it continued during the in fact at the at the this thing um at the dressing room the dressing room it continued there jordan are you both forget dig it dig it dig it only at this goalkeeper lawrence at this 
two players fighting, going toe to toe. In fact, they didn't throw their hands, but an exchange of words in the on a field of play. This video you are watching, you see it clearly that they were exchanging words. The players tried to separate them on the field of play. Oh, on the uh, team, no good team. No, uh, you have to disband the team because there is no way this team will work again. Ah, now next November we are going to play African Cup of Nations qualifiers. So. Two players, Atizigi and Jordan Ayu, are fighting. These two players, if you are calling another Black Star setup for November, definitely you will call them. So what are you going to do? Oh, they will try to res don't resolve any. We have to disband this team. Obi, I say a pamu Obi. Atizigi, I say a pamu Obi. But can you be fighting on the field of play? Field of play, oh, and then it continued at the dressing room. Dressing room to exchange of words. Master Jordan Ayu is not happy because he thinks that the technical team just wants to play beautiful football. They want to be passing, 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 but they don't win games. <laughs> they don't win games. I just think you say, Master, mon pressing anymore. You don't attack. You don't mon just say confusion at the Blasters camp. Serious confusion. Players to players, they are fighting. <laughs> hey, is it a good team no right now? Because I'm a good team now. Team no, I'm a good Ghana. I'm telling you the truth. Look. We all think that we are in a poor position to qualify for the FIFA World Cup 2026. But if the way things are going, if we don't take care, we will not qualify for the FIFA World Cup 2026. I'm telling you the truth. Just as I say, in the group, they are not ready to qualify for the World Cup. That's the only reason why Ghana may qualify to the 2026 World Cup. Do you get the point? Because right now, the baby, I'm telling you the truth. Just as I say, in the group, they are not ready to qualify for the World Cup. Do you get the point? Because right now, baby, a team not drew no. Eh, I was a good team no. Ah. How can two players be fighting on the field of play? You are you are you are exchanging words after losing 2-0. By now, come on, you know, sober. All of you are going. Nobody will talk. You are just calm and then right, you are fighting, you are talking. Hey! Hey, you good team, no. And as a those two players should not be called for November. We shouldn't call them again. Oh master, at least you got them on the more share. Or them on the more share. They are fighting. Now, nah. <laughs> yeah, it's okay. yeah, Mr. Ghana, we have a problem. The problem is that when we sack the coach, eh, I've, I've been listening to people. People are like, oh, it's not a coaching problem. You've sacked because you, have, you brought this one, and then uh, the problem is still there. You've been sacking coaches and bringing coaches, but the problem is still there. But have you asked yourself that the coaches we used to replace the coaches we sack now? Competent enough. That is the why. Why is nobody asking this question? <laughs> Look, Chris Hutton has come. All of us we wanted Chris Hutton to come. English Premier League experience, fantastic manager, fantastic. He came. He couldn't do the job. And then you are replacing Chris Hutton with Coach Otuado, a man who has no experience in coaching. His only experience he has in coaching is when he was the assistant coach for the Black Stars of Ghana. So if you replace Chris Hutton with Coach Otuado. What results do you expect? You expect that Coach Otuado will fix that mess or what? It will not happen. That is what you, that is what people are missing. It is not just about sacking and replacing coaches, but which coaches are we using to replace the ones we've sacked? So right now, we will sack Otuado. They will go and pick somebody. Ah, now look at the backroom staff of, of Otuado. John Pencil, he has calf line since B. John Penzo cannot coach in the Ghana Premier League. He cannot coach in any top league in Africa. No top league in Africa will John Penzo be able to coach. But he's the assistant coach of the Black Stars. So if you bring such a person as your assistant coach, you expect to do well. You expect to do well and play very well and solve the problems that that's, that's, um, um, is at the Black Stars. How, how can you solve those problems? That is what I don't get to. So if you sack Otuado John Pencil and his people and you go and bring another coach who is not tried and tested, who is not good enough, who doesn't have any proper track record and you bring such a person and the person is failing don't say that the problem is above coaches it is not above coaches it's the type of coach you are appointing go and appoint as John, jose Mourinho right now and let's see if jose Mourinho will not solve this problem and appoint us appoint us a competent coach appoint us a have renat and let's see if you will not solve this problem masa oh masa masa ajima bedu eh kasa me fucking eh me draw eh <laughs> Ajima Medu is also speaking, former Black Stars uh, player. Let's listen to what he's saying. 
threatening so black than I or biggest identity as a nation. And also, so say, I told them, and we don't need to massage anything anymore. I am tired, me personally, I'm tired. And baby, I didn't know, you need to be a yabium. Yes, I'm called back, and you're very humble, and you're back because you're also from your local league. To under 17, to under 20, to under 23, to the local blasters, to Emma under 17, under 20, and our, our, our black queens, you know. BBN, because hmm. for the last 15 solid games, blasters won't win the match, is stupid. Hmm. And you think, say, last week, you know, you have a ball, and you have a chance, you know, and compose yourself, you have a say, you know. You say, well, Kwana, the thing is not that good. It's not that good. The thing is not. But the issue is, Say, what's the sun coach is six? Now still, yeah, this is the problem. I think there is corporate somewhere they always escape the the the, the wahala. No? Okay. Because this is the players we have. This is what they are doing in their clubs. They are doing very well. The moment they get to Ghana, now acquire something which is a free and also control quieting. Look at the first goal, two defenders. The boy the boy from Mufini say on block up no say on person yet in you. The success a year of football is over one after What about what will happen? When you need team, you don't have character, you don't have passion, you don't have nothing. Mm. And if you, you can defend this kind of boss, what you have for matches or two, who can pay two matches here? Set pieces in Koyenya, a level 30. Who do you mean for the Kukwa and to net? Individual uh, open play, who do you Individual brilliant is not working. Set pieces is two, it's not working. All right, yes, so that is a um, former Blasters player. Majima Bedu, where Jaffa King, on his way. Kara will be a Joe. Jali, Blasters, a good man, any mercy. Can you imagine? 24 teams in Morocco, Ghana Blasters is not part of them. Hey, Eradi, me, who be that? Hey, Eradi, who mobile? Oh, God, have mercy. Oh, God, have mercy. 24 teams in Morocco, Ghana Blasters. Hey, so the best 24 teams in Africa, Ghana Blasters, you are not part. Confirmed. Ha! God have mercy on us. I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye.